Hey guys, this is Premium Poppy. God bless. I hope you guys are having a fantastic day. You know, I am welcome back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explores the Sky. Let's continue on with the game. Okay, Pokemon, time to get to work. Hurrah! And then everyone goes back to doing their job. Ah, you two. Let me give you your assignment for today. Look at the jobs and yeah. So we're gonna do more quests. So uh, throughout the throughout the story, you're gonna be doing uh, quite a few quests. But I hope you guys' this day is going well. I know mine is. Um, so yeah. Alright, we're gonna continue on with the game. Um, I just got some, some quests. We're going back to the Drench Bluff, so... Not much to do there. Sometimes you gotta wait a little while in order to actually <clears throat> continue on with the uh, the game. Actually, before we continue on fully... Uh, do we have... Yeah, we got money we can put away. So let's do that. Welcome to Deskall Bank. Yep. <clears throat> put away the money... Right, I'm gonna go prepare, then we'll be ready to uh, go on this next quest. Alrighty, we are all set. And let's get going. We are gonna go back... Oh, first things first. We actually gotta accept the quest first. Um, yeah, I'm doing the Drench Bluff, because it's not too difficult of a quest, and it's only floors um, 4 and 5, so... Hopefully the story will be uh, right afterward. <coughs> Alright, but yeah. Hope your guys' day is going well. I know mine is. I'm a bit tired. Had a long day at work today. Um, it wasn't bad, though. I got to go have a Bible study after, uh, after work. That was really fun, honestly. Alright. Um, and there we go. As I said, I'm just going to continue on with this. Um, I really don't feel like exploring all the dungeons. Maybe later on, when I have more time, during the weekend. I, I will definitely be recording this during the weekend. Um... And the longer episodes will be on the weekend, so keep that in mind. Uh, Alright. <clears throat> Had a nice bowl of ramen. Uh, that was that was really good. Had some uh, some bread with that. Feeling kind of thirsty, I'm not going to lie. Uh, I need some water pretty soon. Haven't had water in a while. I don't even know what I'm saying half the time. Ooh, I'll take the apple though. I gotta admit, I, I love the music. I, I always love the music. I think it's awesome. And speaking of which, there's the person we're looking for. Oh. We found Anorith. Anorith? Anorith? Yeah, that's how you pronounce it. No, I don't want to leave the dungeon. Oh, nope. Come on. Yes. Alright, here we go. One thing I really like about this game is, when I do record it, the, the file size is actually really small. Um, the file size is only like, every 30 minutes or so, it's 2 gigabytes. Which is honestly not, not bad at all. I think it's not bad anyway. Stop hitting me, please. Heh, <laughs> nerd, you just lost. Alright, um, anything over here? Nope, nothing. Man, I do like the background I have um, in between both. I don't know why I did that. I like the background I have in between both the um, both the screens, the little time gear. I think that's pretty cool. Uh, you know, yeah, we'll go down. All right, good. Um, I'll hit you. 40 damage, that was quite a bit. And we grew to level 11, not bad. I'm wondering, I still am wondering when we're going to learn a new move. I really want to get a electric type move. I think this is going to be very effective um, later on. Do, 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 do. Oh, no, there's a, uh, a request that we can complete here. Come on. Da, 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 da. There's one. There's two. And uh, Roland grew to level. Oh, Roland's learning another move too. Force. Uh, all right, Force Palm. That is a very good move. I recommend getting rid of either uh, is counter or a fighting move. <sighs> you know what? Yeah, yeah, we're gonna get rid of counter. 
I, I don't think I'm going to be needing counter anytime soon. Force Palm is a fighting move, and it's a really, really good one. Um, it's probably one of the moves that I'm going to keep on this guy for quite a while. I always like Riolu. He's one of the Pokemon that I just love. Alright, we got the White Gummy. Let us leave the dungeon. And there we go. Mission accomplished. That was not difficult at all. Thank you for rescuing me. Please accept this 1,500 coins. Except we get 150. Royal Gummy. Yay! Thank you for getting me the White Gummy. And we get a Reviver Seed. I'll take the Reviver Seed. Reviver Seeds will, um, if you faint, uh, they will he it will heal you um, back to full health or half health, one or the other. And it will restore all your moves. So keep that in mind. Ooh, we received a Gold Gummy and a Grass Gummy. That isn't bad. I didn't even look at the rewards. I was just trying to come, uh, finish these missions. Gold, uh, gold ribbons you can sell and you'll make quite a bit of money off it. I think 2,000 credits. Not credits, excuse me. Wow, why am I thinking... Why am I thinking credits? I was thinking either Star Wars or, like, space games. No. It's, uh... Here we go. Chapter 5. The first official exp uh, exploration. Up and at him! It's morning! Ugh, good morning, Poppy. Would you like to save? Yes, I would. Here we go. The f oh, I, 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 this is one of those cool parts in the story that I like. <clears throat> Everyone, listen up. I have an important announcement to make. Far to the northeast, the farthest, the farthest in into its outermost reaches, there lies a place named Tree Shroud Forest. In Tree Shroud Forest, time has apparently stopped. Huh? Eek! What did you say? You're saying time has stopped. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, that's correct. Time has come to a standstill in Tree Shroud Forest. The wind has stopped. Cl the clouds are motionless. Dewdrops on leaves won't fall. They just hang there, suspended. In Tree Shroud Forest, time itself has truly stopped. T time has stopped? But... How could something th this awful happen? It's unthinkable! Yes, the unthinkable has happened. Why is time stopped in s Tree Shroud Forest? Well, it's because tree s trees, Tree Shroud Forest's time gear was stolen. The time gear was stolen? That's what made time stop. Hey, hey, hey. I heard it was possible, but now it really has happened. I don't get it, though. Why would anyone take a time gear? Quiet, everyone. Officer Magnazone has already started an investigation. It's hard to believe that anyone would dare steal a time gear. But if one time gear can be stolen, the others may be in danger. The officer is asked to be notified immediately if you notice anything, any sus suspicious characters. So keep that in mind. Let's know if you notice anything. That is all. All right, everyone. Here's another busy day at work. Hooray! Oh, you there. You two, come here. You've been quite... You become quite good at your work. I'm impressed with your capture of Drowsy. That was very admirable. So, you all will finally be as, uh, assigned a mission worthy of a proper exploration team. R really Hooray! Let me see your wonder map. Alright, we're gonna open the wonder map. Treasure Town is here. And over here is where, where I'd like you to investigate. See? There's a waterfall flowing here. By all appearances, it's just an ordinary waterfall. But we, we've received intelligence that the waterfall may contain a secret. That's where you come in. We want you to investigate the waterfall and determine what's there. That's all. Do you understand what this mission entails? Yes, I do. Good. Alright, I'll leave it all to you to thoroughly investigate the waterfall. Huh? What's wrong? You're shivering. Are, are you alright? Yes, I'm okay. It's just the anticipation is making me nervous. This will be the first time we get to do a real job as an exploration team. I'm feeling all a little worked up. Oh, I feel like I'm gonna burst from excitement. Let's do our best, Poppy! And here we go. So, I re um, this, this dungeon that we're gonna go to... Oh, first things first. Oh, Poppy and Roland, too. Huh? What's Trimeco doing there? So basically, Chimeko's gonna be talking a little bit. So basically, um, there's a assembly here. 
basically, when you go into a dungeon, you will be able to um, recruit Pokemon on your team. Some missions you will not be able to recruit Pokemon, um, but for most dungeons you'll be able to recruit any Pokemon if you earn their if they you earn their respect. So, yeah, basically. What you want to do, you go into a dungeon, and you, as you battle Pokemon, and you defeat them, sometimes, um, randomly, they will say, Hey, I want to join your team, I like you guys, you're pretty cool, you beat me, let me join you. And that's, that's about it. Yeah, you may have respect from some of them, and these Pokemon will then ask to join Team Darkstar. Once you've recruited a Pokemon, you can bring it along on expeditions. <clears throat> and in order to do that, you've got to um, go talk to Chimeco, and you can recruit them. But let's get going. <clears throat> God bless. I hope you guys are having a great day. Honestly. The Lord is good. And what is this? Huh? What's going on? There are stairs here. There's something written on signs. Huh? What? Spinus Cafe. A shop of hopes and dreams. Opening soon. Win big, it says. Looks like a new shop will be opening soon. But hopes and dreams? I wonder what kind of shop this will be. Let's come back after it's open to find out. So yeah, um, the gummies will play a major role in that shop. So keep that in mind. Alright, let's prepare for this quest and I'll be right back. Alright, and we are ready to go on the mission. <clears throat> Where would you like to go? I want to go to the secret waterfall. I also love how it shows like the little things. Like, um, the characters traveling to their destination. So, this is the waterfall that supposedly has a secret. Ow! That water's coming down hard! Try getting close to the waterfall, Poppy! It's true. This is incredible. I can barely st stay standing near the del 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 Or whatever it is sa I said, I don't know. See? It's intense! If you were to fall under the waterfall, you'd probably get battered. I didn't think it would be pouring down this powerfully. Where could we even start to look? Huh? Something seems familiar. It's that dizziness I felt before. It happened again. I saw something. But what did you just see? Huh? What's the matter, Poppy? What? You had another vision? This time you saw a lone Pokemon leap into this waterfall? And not only that, there's a hidden cave behind the waterfall? Huh. <laughs> but it looks like the water's coming down really heavily. Imagine if there's actually a solid cliff behind the wall. Ouch. If we tried to jump through, we'd be pounded badly. So, Poppy. What do you think, Poppy? Is there really something behind this waterfall? Are you really convinced that there's a cave there? Well, okay. I'm putting my, my faith in you, Poppy. Yes, I totally believe in you! Yikes. Okay, I gotta be brave now. If I get scared and fail the leap through at full speed, I'll be smooshed no matter what I do. If I'm doing it, I'll have to do it without hesitating. Be brave! Be the bravest ever! Ready? Let's go, Poppy! Three, two, one, now! Ah! Ow. What? What's this? Yes, it is a cave. You were right after all, Poppy. Let's go explore this cave, Poppy. Let's see what secrets it holds. So there is a secret... Uh, cave behind the waterfall. Waterfall cave. So, waterfall cave will have lots and lots of water Pokemon. Um, it also will have some poison types. Keep that in mind. Oh, we became terrified. Run! So, um, as you're moving throughout the dungeon, uh, keep it in mind. Um, electric types and grass types will be very, very effective here. This is one of those, again, um, when I first entered this place, I, I thought it was really, really cool. Um, like, th this whole game brings so much nostalgia back to me. I don't know, I don't know why, it's just, I, I love the game. It's, it's great, it's a great game. I own, 
I mentioned this in other videos, but I own actually uh, Mystery Dungeon Red Rescue Team. Oh, here, first thing, before I continue. So yeah, this is uh, Psyduck. Uh, we defeated Psyduck. He wants to join our team. I'm not going to invite him. I don't feel like it. But as I was saying, I own Red Rescue Team. I own uh, Darkness, Time, uh, Sky, uh, Gates to Infinity. I own... Uh, DX, Super Mystery Dungeon. I, I own them all. I, I'm really hoping that uh, Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Explorers of Sky will get a remake. And I hope they don't change a lot, including the music. But I I do... I don't even care if they change the... To be honest, I don't even care if they change the um, graphics or not. As long as they port it to the Switch, I'd be happy with that. Like, I think it'd be awesome to be able to play this game again. Have more people be able to experience this wonderful game. I don't know, that's just me, though. We are on floor 3. I believe there's going to be anywhere from, like, 12 to, uh... 15 floors here. I could be wrong. Oh! There's a low tad. Oh! So, Absorb. Absorb, uh, takes... Uh, does damage to you. And it restores the health of, uh, the, the Pokemon by, by half. So, yeah. A clear gummy, we'll take that. We're not doing too bad, you know? Alright. Waterfall Cave Floor 4. Um, yeah. There's that. <clears throat> Mud Sport. Oh, boy. Electric moves will be not as effective. Tangela would like to join the team. No. Uh, we'll use Quick Attack. That did nothing. We'll try it again. Oh, okay. <clears throat> I wish you the best of luck. It's up to you. Yeah, I am... Uh, so basically... Um, electric types are very, very weak against... Uh, ground type moves. So, keep that in mind. That's not pretty cool, I guess. The Twist Band. I forgot what that does. Okay, the Twist Band. Maintains attack and special attack. I will keep that on me. Because I will be using a lot of special attacks. Because I am an electric type, after all. Um, Alright, let's try and rush through here. Come on, Roland. You got it. Good job. Man, this is a mysterious place. I always liked... Um, I actually set my alarm as the Mystery Dungeon... The one of the Mystery Dungeon themes. I won't say what it is, because it would kind of spoil the epicness of it. <clears throat> so, all the Pokemon here range from Generation 1 to Generation 4. Um... My first ever Pokemon game was actually a Generation 5 game. It was uh, Pokemon Black 2. I really enjoyed that game. It was it was a lot of fun. Um, oh, well, I guess I guess I guess that's on our team. Other um, team Psyduck, send home. Yes, I don't want you on my team. All right, <clears throat> we're gonna continue. We are on Waterfall Waterfall Cave Floor Six. There's that. How dare you hit me. Bruh. Alright. Um. There's that. Sorry if I'm not saying a lot. I'm just, I'm just, I'm just enjoying the music. <clears throat> Alright. Tangela would like to join. No. Yeah, that's a dead end. So we have to actually head up. And there we go. Oh, so orbs. Um, Orbs will do different things. So some orbs, for instance, will... I think... It possibly will blind... I don't know. Uh, there are so many different orbs. So yeah, like... A warp orb will warp a target... Elsewhere, and then the sprint orb will warp enemies randomly. <sighs> Excuse me. We are on floor 7, so that's pretty cool, I guess. You're going to use quick attack on me. I'll use quick attack on you. And we'll do more damage. Surskit would like to join our team. No. We're at 37 out of 100 for our belly. That's, that's pretty good so far. I mean, oh, 
Uh, Wishcash. Wishcash is, I believe, a ground Pokemon along with water. So, keep that in mind. Waterfall Cave Floor 8. It's so mysterious. How dare you. Alright, there we go. Tackle. Come on. Come on. No, you got this. Come on, buddy. Hit him. Knock him out. I probably should be setting my, uh, my, uh, my gravel, uh, my gravel rock. Wherever I put it. No, Geopebble, excuse me. Alright. There we go. Alright. Geopebbles will be very effective long range, so make sure you always keep them on you. I know it might seem like it's just a rock, but and it might not be that effective, but when you're dealing with enemies that are going to be a lot stronger than you are, it will it will really help out in the long run. Oh, come on. Um there's another one. An X seed. We're getting hungry. And what is this? Wow, look at that, Poppy. Look at all these gems sparkling. Whoa, look over there. It's a gigantic gem. Wow, I've never seen a gem this huge. This is an incredible treasure. Everyone will be amazed if we take this back. Roland tried to grab the gem. Ah! 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 Nope, it's not budging. It's really stuck tight. Can you give it a try, Poppy? Poppy took over and tried to pull the gigantic gem out. Whoa. This really is stuck. It won't budge. Ugh. Ugh, no good. So, you couldn't move it either, Poppy. But we can't just give up. If we try hard enough, we'll probably get some kind of result. I'm gonna give it another go, Poppy. Alright, try using a move. Ah! Ah! Hmm. It's not budging one bit. Ugh. Oh no. It's happening again. It's... Ah! But what was that? Uh, ah! It's no good. I can't pull it out. Roland just happened to push like a gigantic gem. Ah, that's... Huh? What's going on? Ah! It's a flood! Ah! Imagine if you were a Charmander in that situation. Ah! I really like how um, it moves to the, like, it shows you going to the top screen. I'm using the bottom screen for the biggest screen, so the Pokemon that you see would be coming up on, on the bottom screen. Yeah. Huh. What? Where are we? Hi. Hi. Are you two okay? You plopped down right from nowhere. Oh, you startled everyone. Where are we? This is a hot spring. H hot spring? Indeed, this is the hot spring. The hot spring works wonders on tiled muscles and creaky joints. Many Pokemon visit here. Tell me, youngster, have you a map? Map? Oh, if you mean our wonder map, yes, we have one. Unfold it for me. There, we are here. This is the hot spring's location. Oh, I, I see. The waterfall is here, so... Hey, Poppy, check this out. The waterfall carried a, the water carried us all the way over here. That's quite a bit away. That's quite a ways away. My goodness, was it the water that carried you all this way? What a long journey that must have been. Let the hot spring wash away your fatigue before you make your way home. Good idea. We'll do that. Thanks, everyone.
Uh, yes, let's save our adventure. <laughs> let me get this. Let me see if I got this all straight. Behind the waterfall, there's a cave. In the, the deepest part of the cave, there's a gigantic gem. When you push on the gem, it triggers a trap of some kind. And surprisingly, you are flushed off to the distant hot spring. Is that the uh, the gist of your report? Yes. It's really disappointing that we couldn't bring the gem back. No, no, no! Emphatically, no! This is a major discovery! Uh, really? Undoubtedly. After all, the presence of the cave behind the waterfall. No one knew about that before. Now! Oh, I see! We made a discovery! When I had those dizzy spells. The shadow of that Pokemon I saw. Looks familiar, honestly. That shape. I've seen that shape somewhere before. That shape. There's no mistaking it. That was Wigglytuff. Yep, that was Wigglytuff. Your waterfall discovery is just amazing. The guildmaster must be told. What? What's wrong, Poppy? Huh? You saying Wigglytuff may have been there, been at that waterfall before? No, no, no! Emphatically, no! That's inconceivable! If that were so, the Guildmaster wouldn't have ordered you to investigate the place, right? Huh, however, since you insist, I will confirm it with the Guildmaster. But, why would they want to spoil their own discovery? How strange. I should be used to it by now. These apprentices are yet another strange crew, aren't they? What was that, Chadot? Oh, what? Nothing, nothing, and nothing at all! Anyway, I'll go confirm what you told me with the Guildmaster. Please wait here. So, how did it go? When I asked the Guildmaster, he mulled over it for a bit, and then he said, Oh, memories, sweet memories! Yilmta! Then he danced around for a bit, and then he said, Yes, yes, when I think hard, maybe I did go there once. And that's just what the Guildmaster said. To sum it all up, as Poppy suspected, he has indeed already been to Waterfall Cave. Oh, okay. That's kind of disappointing. We really thought we'd discover a new place. I wish Willily Tough would have told us right from the start. The Guildmaster can be rather, um, erratic at times. Even I can't quite, can't quite fathom what goes on in his head. Well, that's too bad for you. Nevertheless, I shall expect your best effort tomorrow. Uh... And there we go. We have... Um, that was interesting. Today was exhausting. I should get to sleep early. Uh, we went through a lot today. But you know what? It was, it was incredibly fun for me. Sure, there was that huge letdown. But it was our first exploration. I thought I was going to explode from the excitement and anticipation the whole time. It made me realize I made the right decision in joining an exploration team. One day I'm sure I'll solve the secret of my relic fragment. That's the dream I have. If it ever if it ever came true, I'd surely faint from sheer happiness. Ah, <laughs> oh, we're both laughing. That's 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 cute. But seriously, thanks. I can explore because of you, Poppy. Yes. Be brave. Be the bravest ever! I'm the biggest chicken around, and I even managed to work up the courage. And it was all because you were with me, Poppy. Seriously. Thanks! Oh, yeah. You know what I was thinking? I noticed something about your dizzy spells, Poppy. You always seem to be touching something when they happen. Come to think of it, Roland's right. When I heard a zero... As a real scream. And that other time. And when we were, when we were exploring Waterfall Cave. It 
it's true. It, w it was always after touching something. That's when I got those dizzy spells. When I touch something, I see something connected to it, right? There's one more thing. When we rescued Azuril, you had a vision of the future. But this time, when you saw Wigglytuff going to the cave, right? So that means... This time, you saw the event that occurred in the past. <sighs> That's true. In other words, Poppy, if you touch something, you see its past or future. You must have that kind of special ability. This could be something totally incredible. You could use it in lots of ways, not just for exploring either. The ability could be useful for many things. It's fantastic, Poppy. Well, yes, I guess that's true. But that doesn't mean I always get a vision every time I touch something. It would be useful if I could have visions when I wanted, but... Hey, you two. The Guildmaster wants to see you right away. Guildmaster, I brought you Team Darkstar. Guildmaster? Guildmaster? Hiya! Your team went through a lot today, yes, a, a lot, a lot. But don't worry, I'm keeping watch on your activities. I should tell you why I called you here. We're planning to mount a full expedition soon. An expedition? Yes, the guild will explore someplace far away. It's much harder than exploring out nearby areas. That's why we need to prepare for the big trip properly. We carefully choose which guild members will go on the expedition. Really? Usually, we would never, ever consider rookies to be expedition members. But you two are working so very hard. That's why we're making a special exception this time. We decided to include you in the list of candidates for the expedition. Really? Now, now. You haven't been chosen as, 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 as expedition members yet. There's still time before we set out on the expedition. If you fail to do good work before then, you cannot expect to be selected for the expedition. I'm sure you two can do it. Try hard. Yes. An expedition, isn't it fantastic, Poppy? My heart's pounding all of a sudden. Let's try our best and make sure we get picked for the expedition. Yeah. And then, yeah, they cheer. Chapter 6, Team Skull. The next morning. I will see you guys in the next episode. I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. I know I did. Um, so, yeah. Alright. Uh, saving the game. And there we go. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your day. God bless. I will see you in the next episode. Go outside. Have an awesome time.